Hey guys, I'm super excited to show you what's in version 1.8 of Migrate TV Pro. We have a new import feature and uh, we've put a lot of effort into getting the details just right and I'm pretty excited about it. So uh, what we're looking at right now is the export of that Migrate TV Pro does. So now there's some extra metadata at the very top of an export and the new import feature will actually use this metadata to pre-fill some of the fields for your import. So uh, let's take a look at that right now. Now, if we import that file and then we reveal the find and replace fields, so you can see that it's already pre-filled what we need to find and what to replace it with. Well. We, we already know what to replace it with based on the current site settings, but we normally we wouldn't know what to find in this file unless the file told us. And, and so if, if we import a PHP MyAdmin export, for example, this find field, these find fields are not going to be pre-filled. So let's try that right now. Let's import a PHP MyAdmin export. So now if we reveal the find and replace settings, you can see that we're missing some data here. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to fill this out. And I'm going to choose not to back up. And I will select do not import the active plugin setting. And let's import. And so what's just happening is it's uploading the file and we're using uh, the file API, the browser file API, to upload little bits at a time so we don't run into the upload limit on a lot of servers. Um, so we're, we're, we took a lot of uh, steps there to make sure that it works. Similarly, for this import that's running right now, we're reading from the file that's been uploaded to the server but we're reading little chunks at a time instead of reading the whole file into PHP memory at once and then potentially running up against the PHP's memory limit. So we're doing all that, um, importing. So what's, what's happening right now is it's creating the temporary tables in the database. And now it's uh, running a find replace on those temporary tables. So we really haven't replaced we haven't really touched the tables that are operating on the live site just, just right now. Um, it's perfectly safe to pause uh, this operation right now and resume it later, or we can pause before replacing tables. Um, and we can look at all the tables. All, all this display is, should be very familiar if you're already used to using Migrate TV Pro. All the other push-pull, features and, and everything use the same uh, progress display. And there we have it. We've completed our import. The Migrate DB Pro team worked really hard on this release and I'm really happy with what we've achieved. Uh, and uh, I hope you guys are too.